Hey yo everyone, and welcome to my video. I'm Cliff, if you don't know. Now this summer, I'm looking at different times Jesus used or was around water in the New Testament. Now, I like to play in the water. Maybe ski, or surf some, or just swim around. But some people love to be on the water and fish. Yep, they get up at the crack of dawn, they get some stinky fish food, the stinkier the better, their favorite fishing pole, and off they go. Now, some fish from the side of the lake, and others speed along in a boat. Back in Jesus' day, they didn't use fishing poles, they fished with nets. Well, at least the ones that made their living fishing. Now one day, Jesus was teaching the people, and there was so many people there, that they started kind of pushing him back towards the edge of the water. But Jesus didn't stop. He just climbed in a nearby boat and he asked the owner, a guy named Peter, to push off away from the shore a little bit. And he stood on the boat and he taught the people on the land. When Jesus had finished talking, he told the two fishermen on the boat, hey, push off into deeper water and put your nets down. We'll catch some fish. Now Peter was the owner of the boat and he was just wrapping up a long night of fishing and no one had caught anything. He told Jesus, you know, we had a hard night fishing all night. We didn't catch anything, but because you say so, we'll do it. Sure enough, when they put the nets out, they filled with so many fish that the two fishermen, they couldn't lift it into the boat. They had to call their buddies, James and John, to come help them out. The catch of fish was so much that it filled both boats up. The fishermen couldn't believe it. Peter told Jesus, Lord, please get away from me. I'm a sinful man. Jesus said, hey, don't worry about it. Your fishing days are done. Now you're going to catch men. No, Jesus didn't mean he'd be scooping people up with his nets. No, Jesus knew that he would become one of his followers and would teach others about the kingdom of God. Now, I hope you're scooped up in Jesus' net and are a follower of him. If not, why don't you find a church nearby and you can learn more about him? Well, that's it for today. I hope your day is sunny and your water is cool. Later!